I was just messing around in Blender and I found a trick that I never really see anyone use, but I found it very useful. I just thought that I should share it real quick. So right here, I just have this simple pipe. And if we were to want to put a curve in this pipe at the moment, we would have to extrude and rotate and extrude and rotate, and we just wouldn't get a good result, which is why you normally use curves for pipes. But let's say we just have a situation where we have a cylinder and we want to put a curve in it, or any object for that matter. You can actually use this spin option over here. Before using it, you have to move your 3D cursor over to where the pivot point is. So basically wherever the crevice of the curve is gonna be, so right there. So this is our imaginary pipe. So once your 3D cursor is moved, you can go back to spin and you have the option of doing it on the Z axis, the Y or the X. And in this case, we're gonna use the X. And by clicking and dragging either of these plus buttons, you will then create a curve in the object, which works very well. And then you can just extrude that up and you have a curved pipe now.